Hello guys, what is up? It is Finn here bringing you guys some more NHL 18 franchise, expansion franchise I should say, with our Quebec dorsals and we are ready to uh, get rid of some guys and get some new guys, that is right. So, I have released Ovechkin, I've done that off camera and I also released some other guys, but uh, I don't think there's anyone to really sign right now, yeah I don't think so, but um... I don't know if I want to keep Brown. As much as I like him, I don't think we're going to keep him. Uh, oh, this guy's a 63. I actually would like to sign him. So let's give him a contract. Uh, I just want to know if there's anyone else I should really... Like, this guy's a top 4D, but he's only 61. I guess I'll give him a contract. We'll see what he is. I can always trade him. Uh, any elite so yeah, I shouldn't even bother with these guys. I should just let them grow But anyway, let's see if we can get 200 likes this episode I know we can do it so go ahead hit that like button show that love and support and subscribe and join the dorsal family If you guys feel ever so kind and um, and don't forget to join the discord link is down below uh, So let's go ahead. We're gonna sim to uh, no not yet. I no, I think I'm good <coughs> Actually let me see how much space is on the roster, just in case I have to release anyone. Uh, so let's see what we have here. We're only retaining one salary. I don't know who it is. Oh, we have five. Uh, oh, no, we're going to have a little bit less than that. But let me just see what's on the team right now. Let me just see, like, what centers we have. Well, there's a lot, and I don't think we need this many. So this Gilbert guy, I kind of want to keep. 2166. Do you think he's worth it? I mean, in my opinion, no. I don't think he's going to have a shot. He could, but I don't know. I don't think we need him with all these low top nines. But even they aren't that great. But I want to keep this guy because he is... You know what? I'm going to release him. I just... I don't think we'll, we'll need him. This guy I'd like to keep, though. So I'll give him a contract. Offer him a little less. Uh, what else do we have? I just want to sort by position just so I know what I'm working with here. These guys are... There's there's a lot of players in my system. Uh, I'm not going to sign any of these guys. Actually, the 61. Mm, I think they... I can't remember if they grow better if you don't sign them. Can I buy him out? How much will that cost? 73. for two years I just don't want to pay him that much I'd rather trade him well we'll see if I can trade him once this once it comes up but um let me see what else we have defense we don't have a whole lot so I should probably keep these guys actually I should even sign this other guy too just so we have some depth yeah I'm gonna offer him a contract it's okay to have 60s in the minors I even have 50s. Goalies, though. Uh, I like all the goalies we have, especially this guy, because this guy can grow. This guy's a 72 backup, which isn't bad, and Schneider's 77. So, I like to keep those guys. Jeffrey Fringe Starter. Well, we don't have to sign him. We can keep him right now and see what happens with him. So, I'll go ahead and keep him on the club for now. All right, I think we're pretty much good. I think we're ready to, to simulate and see what happens. Uh, so let's sim to free agency and see if we get any accepts. Accepted, 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 accepted. Okay, so now I think that was five contracts, so we might have to release some guys. I'm not sure, though. Or trade. I don't know if we can even trade yet. But I might have to buy out Brown because I would like to sign someone. All right, here we go. Let's see what they did with the trade block. All right, I want to put stone on it, actually. Yeah, he's only a 79 overall. He must be upset. Yeah. Let's put him on it. Because <coughs> I'm alright with getting rid of him. Um, Man, all these guys hit exact, which kind of sucks. Look at Valeno, though. 86. I think, I think Hart hit 90. Yeah, he did 90 overall. How awesome is that? I'm going to keep this other guy, though. I mean, I might end up trading him. I don't know. Uh, who else do we have, though? That we could put on the block. Maybe this top four. I don't know. 
I'm thinking about it. I'm actually gonna... I think I'm gonna put him on. Yeah, I think so. Just to see what we can get for him. Well, I don't want guys in their 50s. That's for damn sure. I hate how they do this. They do so bad with it. It's ridiculous. Alright. To like age 25. No, 20... Yeah, 25. Because I, I would rather have younger defensemen. Alright. Uh, for forwards, we'll do any. Don't need anyone right now. But younger guys, preferably. Like in the 23, we'll do. So what's that? Like top six, I think I did? Yeah. And we don't need goalies, that's for sure. So actually, I'll just remove this one. Remove, okay. Once, future picks, I'll take first and second. I don't need third and fourth. And for current picks, first and second. Okay, I don't know why I would want a fourth round pick. Okay, nice. Uh, FTW means for the win, gooey. All right, here we go. Uh, I guess we'll keep our first round pick up there just in case. I don't know why this is our surplus. I'm kind of tempted to just get rid of the surplus. Because I think that's what screws us up. All right, so any forward that is 17 to 50 with, what's that, top nine? Bottom six. Okay, that works. And then we'll do the same for defense. Defense, any... 17 to 50, that is about here. What's that? 7th? Yeah, okay. And let me just turn all this off. Okay. And then we should be good. Actually, we'll keep, we'll keep 4 plus on. Okay. Just so it tells people that we don't want any of that. All right. So we got stone on there. I don't know. Can I actually trade yet? I can. So maybe I can trade Brown. Because I would like to. And I don't mind what I get for him. I mean, he doesn't have the best trade value, I'm sure. He might even have the least. No, Haig does. Where is Brown? If he's not that low, that would be awesome. Did I buy him out? I can't remember if I did. Maybe I did buy him out. I can't remember what wing he was. I think I did buy him out. Oh no, there he is. Like honestly, I'll take a I'll take a seventh round pick for him if someone wants to. If no one will take that, then I'll just buy out his contract. But I just want to get rid of him. I don't want him on the team anymore. Oh wow, they did accept it. I was actually surprised because he he was a low player with a good amount of money all right uh that he cost so let me just see contracts real quick i just want to see how much space we have so i don't offer any contracts and then they reject because of you know how much we had all right what's the cap space we got a good amount and we only have one contract okay oof um might have to do some other tra trades i want to trade stone though because he costs a lot of money <coughs> <coughs> and we could sign someone for him. Uh, so let's see what I can get for him. I just don't know if people are going to want that salary he's he's carrying. You know what I mean? That's the only problem. But we do need a, we do need some uh, expensive players, that's for sure. So let's see who the Ducks have. Let's see who they got that maybe we could get for him. Like Caudry or this 52 overall. I don't want him. Um, this guy wouldn't be bad. Jensen. I don't know if we'll get far enough into our franchise where we actually get to see him play. I'll take this Legwan guy. Would they do that? Oh, wow. Wow, we got that guy. Okay, I was not expecting that to go through. But I'll take it. The guy had to be cheaper, so... All right, I will I will take that. That sounds good to me. All right, let's see uh, who else we have on this team that maybe we don't quite need. See, the, the thing is, I really wish I could see other players. You know what I mean? Uh, he's not costing us a contract right now. Look at all these elites we have. It's awesome. I love it. Uh, top six forward. Keep him. What's the one guy that we have? Is he not considered a rookie? 
Or maybe he's just low on the team. Yeah, Abramov. He's 78. I kind of want him to play this year. I hope he's going to be ready. See, how's Frost ready, but he's not? Makes no sense. I don't know if I'm going to call up Frost yet, though. All right, well, let's see what contracts are available. Because we don't have a lot of space on the team. And what really sucks is I want to see, like, who's available. And I want to see what my lines are so I know if I should trade anyone. Wow, Drew in. And Kreider. I don't want Kreider. Fiala is an unrestricted, but he's only... He's 26 years old, so he probably won't grow that much. Brodeen, we had him. No interest, really. But Drew in would be a nice guy to pick up. Do we need him, though? Probably not. I don't, we definitely don't need D, that's for sure. I might just not sign anyone. Oh my gosh, Thornton's an 82 at 43 years old? That's pretty impressive. He's still a lot of money, though, so I'm not too interested. Let me see if there's any, oh, see what I mean? This is why I wanted to look here. Uh, well, I'm definitely going to sign this guy. For sure. Top six forward at 19 years old. Hell yeah. And then this this guy I think I might sign too. 68 at 20 is not bad. So I know that's two contracts we have. Do I what do you guys think? Do I offer Drew in something? I I think I have to. Like I think it has to be done. Why wouldn't he come to our team? And we need the we need to offer someone something. I'll give him 9.1. Seven years though? You know what? We can always trade him. We'll see if he takes it. I know we don't really need him, but we can always trade him and get something. You know what I mean? Uh, let me see. We have to trade some guys now for sure. And trade him for value later. Exactly, as saying. That's what I was thinking. So we'll see how he does if other players start to decline that I actually like. Like, this is our first line pretty much. And actually, one of these guys is going to be on the second. I think it was Skinner. Or Reinhardt. One of them were on the... Hopefully one of them's... Okay, good. Second. First. Okay, good. So Skinner can be on the second line. And same with Reinhardt. Sweet. Okay, that is actually awesome. And he's a second line for... Okay, great. That actually makes me feel a lot better. Okay. Uh, let me see who else we have. Because I do want to trade some guys. We kind of have to now. Because we offered three contracts. And we only have space for one. So, I think it... Uh, Dubois, I'm definitely keeping... Uh, I thought he was an 83. I guess he went down a little bit. I could trade the 63 top six. Maybe for a pick. Let me see who we can get a pick from. That's not doing too well. They're hopeful. Let's see if we can get someone from Vegas. Well, not someone, but like a pick, I mean. Let's see if they'll take a fifth. Or if I can get a fifth. Trade accepted. All right. I guess that was a pretty good trade for them. But I just I just don't need some of these guys. Oh, that was the defenseman, though, that I kind of needed. Oh, damn. I didn't realize that. Uh, you know what? There's six. But I don't think we signed any defensemen. So we should probably get rid of some forwards on this team. Patan. Patan. Do I want this guy? He's cheap, though. And he's not that bad. So I kind of want to keep him around. And this Carlson guy I don't think is going to grow. So I'm going to trade him. He's only 72, 24 years old. He didn't even have that great of a year. 38 points. We'll put him together. We'll see if we can get like a package deal. You know what I mean? Uh, let's see who else is on this team. Bottom six, high. Greer. Nah, I'm not going to keep him around. And then who else is there? I know there was that center, Kari. I don't know if he's still on the team though. No, he is. I did let him go. This guy ain't going to go anywhere. This Klein and Colt. Yeah, I'll, actually, this guy might. The Klein. I think I'll keep him. Setaguchi. 60. I'll package him up, too. Chmielewski. Oh, he ain't going anywhere. I don't think either of these guys are. Yeah, especially him. Nah, he ain't going to be anything. No offense. B bottom six. Yeah, well... Oh, I'm out of space. Okay. So just all these guys for maybe a third? I wonder if they would do a third. Probably too much. Fourth? Let's see if they'll take a fourth. I almost feel guilty. Okay. You know what? That's fine. That's a good trade for me because I, I freed up a lot of play a lot of space 
on our team. And I got a pick out of it for guys that were just never going to be anything for us. You know what I mean? So I'll take it. Sounds good to me. All right. I might. I do want to see if there's any defensemen, though, that could grow. Uh, oh, wait. This is my. Let me just see how much space. Okay, good. We have six, six contracts that we can do. Okay, good. Yeah, because we just traded a lot of guys. So I really hope we get Drew in, though. That would be awesome because we only have one legitimate first line guy, and that's. Uh, no, I think Mantha was. I think it's Mantha and Valeno, so we could bump up. Well, Drew N will be on our first. And then Skinner and, and uh, Reinhardt on the second. Oh, that's going to be such a killer team. We're going to win the cup again this year, guys. It's got to happen. All right, so let me just see. Um, What did I want to do? I can't remember what I want to do. Oh, yeah, I want to look at free agents again real quick. Hart is killing it. He's a 90 overall at 24 years old. I'm sure winning the cup helped him out a lot. Uh, And I think he won the cup. Twice, yeah. Uh, so we got Drew N. Let me just sort by defenseman because I'd like to see if there's any, like, elites. Okay, so there's a 65 at 20 that I did not offer a contract to, which I definitely need to. Is anyone else interested in him? Just one. I can all only give him 9.5. He's got to go to the championship team. I mean, come on. Anyone else? Top four. Oh, but he's 24 years old, this flurry guy. I'm tempted to, though. I just don't think he'll grow. 69 at 23. 65 at 20, but he's top four. Low. 64 at 19. I might take the chance on him. And only... What's his ratings? The other guy looks better. This guy. Uh, I think I'll go for him. 64 at 19. Yeah, I'll offer him a contract. No one else is interested, so. All right, I think that might be all we can do for now. So let me go ahead, and I'm not going to give Brodeen anything. Let's advance and see if anyone accepts with us. I really hope Drew N does. That would suck if he didn't. Well, we could bump someone up. All right, so Sawatsky accepted. So we got a 64 defenseman with top four potential. Butsayav. I hope I said that right. Batsayev, Batsayev, accepted. Kalinin, Kalinin, accepted. All right, so that's good. Still no sign from Drew N. Oh, you know what? Let me see what goalies are available. I don't know if anyone signed yet. Let's just see. Mm, doesn't really look it. Are there any, like, restricted? I, I'm just curious to see. Like, any, no one really big. Actually, they kind of suck. Let's get this guy, bottom six. Actually, if he was younger, I'd pick him up. Like, if he was 24, 25, I'd probably take a chance on him. But, all right, let's go back to all. I just want to see what goalies are available. Wow, Vasilevsky and Corpy. Look at how many teams are, are, you know, interested in those two. I'd actually sign this guy if he was younger. Just to place him in the minors. Let me just see if there's any good goalies that could be good. Oh, there's a medium starter. At 64. Do I have the... I think I do. I don't know if I have the space. I might actually offer him a contract. Actually, all of these guys wouldn't be bad to offer. Just to have, like, some depth. You know what I mean? I don't know if we need them, though. What do you guys think? Should we sign those goalies? Let me see how much... I think we only have two offered right now. And how many... How much space do we have on the team? I don't know how our salary is so low. We offered two contracts, and we have space for three more. We could always trade guys. And we do need some people in the minors, but goalie-wise, I don't think we do because we have an elite goalie right now in the minors. So th I think our minors include this guy and Schneider. Although I could get rid of Schneider... But I kind of want to keep him just in case of an injury. And Dembski's, I know he's a backup, but he's 72, which isn't bad for 20 years old. And then there's also this guy who's a medium starter. So maybe, well, I could sign him and trade him. That would be the only thing I'd want to do. Sign the 63, 19-year-old. Uh, 
Oh, wait, hold on one second. Ja, ja Max 74 Hey, Finn, I was in your chat last week telling you I was close to having my fourth child while my wife is a week overdue and still no baby girl. Wish us luck. Well, good luck to you, man. I hope you have a very healthy baby. And uh, be ready. Be ready because a week overdue. She should be coming out any time. So be ready, man. And I hope you guys have, again, a very, very healthy baby. So good luck to you guys. Seriously. I wish you guys the best of luck. Fourth kid. Wow. Hopefully that won't be too much for you. I know I'm not ready to take care of a kid. <laughs> That's for sure. I'm excited, though. I definitely want... I just want one boy. That's all I want. I, I'll take three girls and one boy. I just want one boy. That's all I want. I just want to... And I hope he plays sports. I hope he likes video games. I just really... Can you imagine if I'm still doing YouTube in 15 years and I have a kid that's, like, into games? You know what I mean? That would be awesome. All right. Anyway, back to the goalies. Let's see who we had here. And they weren't restricted. Were they? Were they? Okay, they weren't. Our one guy was, but he's a fringe, so I'm not worried about him. These are all guys that probably just didn't get signed. Alright, so someone told me to sign this 19-year-old. So I think I'll offer him a contract. But I think that's the only one I can do right now. I might sign this guy, but I'm not sure. I might want to go for, like, a younger. Never mind. Yeah, these are the only guys to offer. Alright, well, let's see what happens. All right, what's going on, J-Cap? How are ya? All right, let's advance and see what happens. Vananen accepted. Still no sign from Drew N. Oh, he did. I was extremely happy to accept your offer. Your cash offer was most generous. It really was quite easy to make up my mind. Sweet, and that will help us a lot with uh, the cap because I know we have to be at, like, a certain amount. So that's very good. Now, let me just look at contracts again and see. I think we have, like, space for one more or two more. I just want to double check. How long have I been doing this for? Only 22 minutes? Wow, it's felt a lot longer. Usually these are like 40 minute episodes. Uh, I have space for one more, so this one goaltender will probably be the last guy. Thanks, man. I have three boys already. 43, by the way, so plenty ready for number four. Oh, wow. Jeez. Well, congrats, man. Best of luck to you. Jared, by the way. Is Jared your uh, your name? I'm assuming that's what you mean. And do you know if this, 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 uh, the baby you're having next, do you know if it's a boy or a girl? Okay, let me see. Uh, where do I want to go? Finn, do you like the Oilers? I'm not an Oilers fan, but I don't hate them. I'm not a big McDavid fan. I kind of think he's, I don't know, he doesn't seem like a guy I'd want to go out and have dinner with you know what I mean like he just seems I don't think I'd get a smile from him like he just doesn't seem like a very happy guy like when I saw him at the awards he did not seem thrilled to have won the award he got I was like wow really you're how old and you can't be like he's what 19 20 I think he's 20 and dude like what did he win last year it wasn't the Calder did he even get the Calder no I think he did his first. no I don't know if he did because he got hurt and they say it was Brandon Manning, but look, I know I'm a Flyers fan. That was not his fault. I really don't think it was. All right. Oh, Bull Duck rejected. Was oh, you have a full roster. Okay, so I think that's the goalie thing. I think that's why. A girl, she will be protected. Three older brothers. That's awesome. That's good. You you know, you get the uh, the chance to uh, to. Vary it up a little bit now that you're having a girl. That's awesome, man. Best of luck to you. Seriously. All right, let's see. Goalies. I could get rid of Parsons. Nah, we need the backup because I'm not going to get this guy. Um, If I just... No, I can't. I don't think I can just release him. Um, So I'd have to get rid of one goalie. And I kind of like the guys we have. Like, But I feel like it would be better to just... I don't know. What do you guys think I should do? Panarin got the Calder. Did he? Wait, did he really? Hold on. I got it. No, oh, I can't go back that far. Never mind. Thank you, J-Cap. For... Oh, wow. A sub. Thank you, J-Cap, for the sub. Appreciate it. Thank you very much, my man. means a lot. Thank you. Welcome to the... 
to the exclusive dorsal family. Now you get yourself the emote. Let's go ahead and see it. But, uh, yeah, I know McDavid blamed Manning for hitting him, but really, I think they just skated into each other, and he, like, lost his balance. It wasn't McDavid's or uh, Manning's fault. It was like a collision with, I think, three players. And I think Manning went to make sure he was okay, too. Like, if, and I met Manning. He's actually a pretty nice guy. Very quiet, though. Like, he doesn't, like, again, he doesn't seem like a very happy guy, Brandon Manning. I have his stick, and he signed it for me, too. He literally gave me a stick after practice. I asked him for it, and he walked right over and just handed it to me. And he gave an, his other stick, to I think, to a kid. So, so yeah, that was awesome. And then I said he signed it for me, and he did. And he gave, I mean, he doesn't have the best signature, but. He signed it. He was a very nice guy, too. And it's a good stick. It's not broken or anything. Like, I could go out and use it right now. But they got the money. <laughs> so, all right. Uh, what was I going to do? Oh, yeah. What do you guys think I should do with this goalie? Like, I don't know. I, I kind of want to sign him, but just to trade him. You know what I mean? Because I, d I don't think we're even going to get far enough into our career with this team that we're even going to see any of these guys. You know what I mean? Maybe we'll see this guy, but, like, let's think about this. Like, we got these two, right? Hard ain't going anywhere. I'm not going to trade him. You know, I don't even think we're going to get to as far into this career where we get to see him retire. So, I think he'll be, by the time we're done this series, at the, at the oldest, 28. So, he's out of the question. Parsons, maybe we'll go. But when Parson goes, it'll probably be either Schneider or this guy. You know what I mean? So that's why I'm like, should I just trade this dude or this dude? You know what I mean? So I don't know. Uh, I don't know what to do. But I kind of wanted to sign that guy just to have a guy with value. But now that I think about it, is it really worth it? You know what I mean? Wait, what is our... I just want to see what our thing was at. Our bar. Or does it not show it here? It doesn't. But we have cap space. Oh, can I actually offer extensions now? I didn't know that. Oh, wow. He wants a lot of money. But I think... Should I just... Should I give him that many years? I kind of want him to be a lock for us, but that's a lot of money. Wait, let me do this. Trey Schneider, your medium elite needs a starting role. Yeah, he does. But the thing about trading Schneider is that what if someone gets hurt? You know what I mean? Like, is this guy ready to go? I mean, I guess I could sign someone or trade for someone. I know Parsons will probably take over, but, you know. You know what? That would put us in an interesting situation, actually, if he got hurt, uh, both of our goalies. You know what I mean? That would be kind of interesting to see, like, Luamala or Dembski or Watt get called up. You know what I mean? And we'll probably just sign some guy for a little bit, like a rental, a cheap guy. Um, All right. So let's get a salary cap. And I'm going to trade that Schneider, I think. I think I'm going to do that. But hold on. I just want to see how much Hart wants. Because I can do this for... A, I forget how many times you can offer them a contract until they don't want an extension. But I might... Do I give them the eight years? It's, it's tempting. Or do I give them less? I'll give them four. No, I think I should give him eight. I don't know. Well, he could go down. So let's do six. So I'll do 11.9 times 0.85, which means I can offer him 10, 10.115. So we'll do 10.125. Okay. Your options, you're with our team still. You ain't going anywhere. Yeah, all these guys. I don't know if I'll... Oh, wait, I can't... No, I can re-sign him, but he's not ready for an extension yet. I don't know if I'll keep capping in. He has to grow to at least an 80 for me to consider keeping him. Because he does cost a lot of money. Uh, and then we have all these guys, but I'm not worried about them yet. Okay, good stuff. All right, sorry, I wasn't looking at the chat. Let me get back on Twitch here. There we go. All right, I couldn't see what was uh, going on before. Let me just see. What's going on, Jordan? Welcome. All right, uh, eight years, do it. Nah, I gave him the six. It 
call Scott Foster. They got to put him in the next game. Just pay him a couple hundred dollars just for him to get put in the game. You know what I mean? All right, so let's see if I can trade these goalies that are probably not going to play. Uh, so let's see what we have here. Let's go goalies. All right, so this Watt guy, I definitely want to play. And this guy too. So let me just see the rules. Other goalie. So I don't know what that means right now. Because it doesn't even give me like if they're an AHL goalie. Other goalie. Well, what's it say for Schneider? Schneider says minor starting goalie. So what does he say? Other goalie. You know what I mean? That's what I don't understand. Okay. I could trade the fringe starter. I think I'll trade him. And I guess I'll trade Schneider too. So I'll trade Schneider. The fringe. And should I trade Dembski? Do you guys think I should trade Dembski? What do you think? Scott Foster has never let in a goal in the NHL. Technically, he is invincible. Or, yeah, invincible. Uh, and thank you, Eddie, for the host. Appreciate it. So should I trade all three of these guys and just sign this one dude? Hopefully, he's NHL ready. That's why I always like to keep one. Don't trade Dembski? Okay, I won't trade him then. So I'll just trade these two. That way, it's always good to have two goalies, I think, scratched in the minors. Oh, wait, let me get the other guy. I forgot to get him, the Jeffrey. I don't think he'll amount. Uh, he might hit 60 if we're lucky before he's 20. Uh, and who do I want to get? I don't think I want a player. I think I want a pick. Let me see what picks I even have for this year. I have first, second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, and seventh. Okay, so I do. Do I have all my first? I. Oh, no, I do have a 20. Okay, I think I do have all my first now. Yeah. Because I remember I didn't because I had to trade them for a few guys. I could go for some fourth and thirds if possible. Some thirds would be nice. Oh, wow, they're champions? The Coyotes? Oh, yeah, that's who we played in the Stanley Cup, I think. Any rebuilders? Oh, my gosh, the Pens are rebuilders. Wow. So their picks might be a little bit tougher to get. Let me see if they'll take the third. We might actually be able to get a little something better than that. Maybe even their fourth. Let me see. Okay. We got a third and fourth round pick for those guys. I'll take it. Good stuff. All right. So we have the goalies. Uh, let me just see how much contracts we should we have. We should have three spots now, I believe. So I guess we will get that. No, we have two. Okay, my bad. But we, we still have offered one guy. I forget who it was. I think it was the other goalie. But the the only purpose of in signing these guys were just to trade them for something. So, let me see if there's any of these goalies still available. A couple good players still available. Is Thornton? Yeah. If Thornton was cheaper, he wouldn't be a bad guy. He just turned 44 now. Wasn't he 43 before? But he'll just go down. If he was like $2 million, but I don't need him. So, that's why I wouldn't get him. But I'd only offer him a one-year deal. But he wants four. And I think they can retire before they're done. All right, let me see who we have here. All right, so we still have... We have two guys, so I'd get this guy, the McAllister. No one else is interested in him, so I guess I'll give him a, co a contract and see if he'll take it. And thank you for the follow, Blue Jays fan. Appreciate it. Welcome to the Dorsal family. And thank you for the bid, Cap. Thank you very much. All right, let's advance and see. Apparently, we had, like, two... Con oh, no, I think the one was Hart's extension. All right. McAllister accepted. All right. So, waiting on Hart's extension, though. All right. So, I think we're pretty much done. Let me just see what the trade value is of that guy we just got. Because if it's good, we could get someone right now. But I'll probably wait a little bit and see. All right. The McAllister does have good trade value. And it's actually the same as Watt. Obviously, I'm not going to trade Watt. But, because he... Him... Him and Luamala are the guys that I'm hoping are going to be the future of this team. I don't want to trade anything yet until I see what this team, you know, can become. So let's go ahead and send to the next season because I think we're good. And Hart accepted. Good. So he's a lock for the next six years until he's 30. So because that's when I think he'll be a little cheaper. All right. Saber second round in Narena for Taylor. Let me just see what these guys are. 
Because I don't think we need deep men, but I kind of need the depth and the miners. 61. And what's this guy? 63. And a second round pick. That's actually not bad. What do you guys think? I don't know. Because I feel like this is the guy, like a guy I would get in the draft. Mm, you wouldn't accept it? I don't know. I mean, it's a second round pick from a rebuilding team. So they're probably going to be pretty high this year in the draft. And then this guy's a 63, 19 years old, but low top six. He's got decent speed. Because it, it'll get better eventually, I'm sure. But the deking kind of sucks. I would. Yes. You guys think I should accept it? I mean, it's kind of... It's I don't know. I don't see... He's 20 years old, 61. So I don't know what his chances are of becoming good. I usually think you, you should be at least a 65. At the very least, at 20. 70 is good. Alright, um... What's their first looking like? Because maybe I'll take their first. You know what? Let's do this. Give me your first. And I'll give you that goalie. And we'll see what the trade value looks like there. Uh, the McAllister guy. Oh, Buffalo would have too many goalies. Damn. Well, maybe I'll take one of them. And just trade them. <laughs> or as long as there's a guy with no contract, I could do that too. Oh my gosh, they have so many goalies. And why wouldn't it let me sign any of them? Well, I guess because all of them are not signed. Um, who's their other NHL guy? Oh, wow, they're in trouble. They need a goalie. This guy's their backup? Although he does have, he does have promise. 68 at 21 years old isn't that bad. Um... So he could be good. And he's medium starter. I'll take this guy. This Paris. Or the Antella. I don't know. And thank you for the bit. Uh, J-Cap. And Blat, Blat, Blayton. LOL. Thank you for the follow buddy. Appreciate it. Alright let's go with Antella. And see if they'll accept this. Uh, they still would. So I have to take an actual goalie from them. Alright I'll take this guy. Whatever. Would they accept this? Because it wouldn't. What do you guys think? Would this be a good trade? Nah, I'm not gonna flip a coin. That's something Alex would say, my friend Alex. I don't know, cause I kind of want the first round pick, cause I doubt we're gonna be that high in the in the draft lottery. I don't know if we need the pick, but it would be nice to have, cause I don't think we need these players either. So, you guys would do this, yeah? I mean, it's a first round pick and a decent prospect. A top six, that is. So he could definitely play in the minors. Do it? Okay, let's see if they'll accept it. Rejected. Alright. Um, I guess I'll just take the second round pick, because you're not going to take this, are you? Do I even have anything that would, like, fulfill this? I'll see if I have a guy that I could give you. That, like, I don't have faith in ever becoming of anything. Dansk, no, I'm not getting rid of him. 64, 19, no. Top 4, 21, no. Uh, maybe this guy, this... Oh, but I need defensemen, that's the problem. Uh, alright, I'll just take that second round pick, I suppose. Actually, no, they probably wouldn't give me Calgary's. Whatever, I'll just take Buffalo's. That's fine. Okay. Alright, I'll take it, why not? Did I get rid of Stone? I did, right? I forget what... No, did I get rid of Stone? I think... I don't know if I did. Oh, I forgot to upgrade. My bad. Well, let me see if there's anything else, because I can upgrade now before we get to the next season. If there's something you want me to upgrade. Alright. Oh, wow, a lot of these need... I usually wait till we get to... Oh, I don't have the, the budget to do anything now. Well, let me repair this before it's too late. Yeah. And let me see if we have... Oh, good. We still have a lot of money. All right. Just spend the rest on uh on the budget for this. Say budget. Okay. 
and repair. Okay, good. I might as well repair this while we have the, the money now. Okay. Good stuff. Thank you, Jordan, for the uh for the bit, buddy. Appreciate it. Those hot dogs look good. What hot dogs? I don't know what you're looking at. Alright, uh let's see. What how much time are we at? Forty minutes, okay. I don't want this to hit an hour. But uh let me see. We already signed, I think, everyone. Do I still have stone? I can't remember if I traded him. All right. Um. Yeah, I can't remember if I kept stone or not. Because I don't think I want him if I did. I did get rid of him. I don't remember what I got for him. I think I got picks. Or did I get something decent? No, I got that top six guy. That's right. Okay, I remember. When you were repairing stuff, the first image was hot dogs. Repairing. Repairing? I don't know what you're talking about. I'm confused. Oh, well. Um, let's go ahead and just sim the next season. I think I want to see what the team's looking like. And if we should call up anyone and maybe still do some trades. Thank you, Thomas, for the bits, buddy. Appreciate it. So you can watch ads for bits. How many bits do you get if you watch an ad? Like 10? One? If it's only one, that kind of sucks. Unless they can autoplay ads, because that would be pretty cool to just, like, autoplay an ad. Like, if you're going to do something, like hopping in the shower or something like that. Oh, look at the season tickets. That is awesome. Almost 100% sold. Two to ten. Okay. Oh, an owner. Oh, okay, I got you. I, I know what you're talking about now. Oh, thanks for the one point, or the point one four eight million. I appreciate that. All right. Let's get down to business. All right, let's see what owner goals you got. Because I could do some upgrade something now. Our concessions. Okay. I can do that. I want us to earn at least 76% of my... Okay, I'll try that. Let's see who the captains are. I'm hoping it's still Reinhardt. He should still be our captain. Mantha, Armia. I'm going to unassign him. Although I did like him in the he did he was a good player for us. Um Alright guys, I'll let you decide who gets alternate. We got Mantha and Reinhardt. I think it should go to Oh wait, we got an extra player here. Oh Haig. Yeah, that's who it was last year. Um I think it should go to all of your Yeah, I know, right? That's why I don't want it to be all wingers. But I will I'd be okay with Skinner or Valeno getting it. Dubois, Valeno. I don't think it should go to Dubois. If I was going to give it to a defenseman, probably Lilligren. Just someone who's been on the team for a while. Brandstrom, I don't think he's been on the team for that long. Valeno, I'm seeing, well, Jordan and Eddie said Valeno. No, not Haig. Haig scratched most of the season. All right, I'm seeing a lot of Valeno, so I'm going to give it to him. I think he deserves it, too. He's going to be a great player for us. So, I'm sorry, Armia. All right, let's see what the lines look like on this team. I'm very excited to see this. Reinhardt's second line and Mantha's first. So I'm going to put Mantha on the first because that's what he is somehow. All right, we still have that righty-lefty, which I love. And Konechny is, I guess, going to be our center. Oh, but Dubois is second. Oh, that sucks because I really wanted him to be on the... And then we have this McLeod guy. All right, let's do this. I, I don't really want to, but who's better face-off? 83, yeah. Uh, let's do this. There we go. And he's third line, which is good. Third line. Abramov got called up. That's good. I actually want him on the team. Uh, and he's 79. And Kapanen, I'm sorry that uh, you have to be put all the way down there. All right, so Drew in first line, first line. And these guys should all be... Second. Good. Okay. Although I really want Dubois on the second line, so that kind of sucks, but oh well. All right. Defense. Love the defense. Absolutely love it. Let me just make sure. I don't think we have anyone good enough to be top two now. Uh, Lilligram was on our first line last year. I think Gianto was on the third. I can't remember, though. Let me just switch these two so we have righty lefty. Oh my gosh, it should all be, uh, should I bump Lilligren down? I actually kind of want to. I think I am. Yeah, I am. 
just because Sonnenberg's younger by two years, and he could grow by actually getting him on the top four. So Brandstrom can stay up there because he's medium. And Shabbat. Okay, who's scratched on this team? McCann. Okay. Oh, we could have traded him. And Haig. All right, so let's take a look at the miners now. Who's this guy? I don't remember. Was he our draft pick? I think he was. No, he... Oh, that's the guy we just drafted. That's right. But he should be on the team, apparently. Um, well, I don't think any of these guys are NHL ready. Let me just see you scratch on this team. Wait, did I see a 77? See, this guy is... He's ready to go. Now he's a minor starter. And Dembski's a minor backup sweet. So who's scratched on the team? Probably those two goalies, right? Suglabov. I don't know who that is, but I don't really want him on the team. And I don't think I can get rid of him. I think he's one of those players that I can't get rid of, which sucks. How much is on his contract? No years. So how's he on the team if he's got no years remaining? Whatever. All right. Uh, do I want any? I kind of want some of these guys to play, like this 65 winger. Instead of uh, the Barkov could maybe play. Klein. Mm. Uh, maybe they shouldn't play. I don't know. Yeah, Leguan is a great last name. But I think this Leguan guy should get called up. But I don't know who I would scratch for him. But he's a third-line guy, apparently. And I liked Patan last year. I don't know how good he did. Oh, he only had 19 points? Well, maybe he wasn't that good. He actually wasn't. I could trade Patan. Or send him down. You know what? Let's send him down. He can help out our miners a little bit. But I do think I have a lot of trades to do because I have a lot of guys scratched in the minors that I kind of want to play. Oh, wait, he's not a center. That's right. I think he's a right winger. Yeah. So let's do that and then call up that leg one guy. I hope he's good at face-offs. Is he? 72. Uh, so I guess he won't be our center. Wait, no, 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 no. There we go. Yes, okay. So added lines. Uh, I don't know who's going to be my my center now on this line. I guess I could just make it the Leguan guy. I don't know. Armia can't do face-offs. Dubois kind of can, but I don't really want him on the fourth. But I want this guy to grow. That's why I want to put him on the third. I don't want to put Armia on the fourth because that's when he'll start to decline. But he's a good player, Armia. Like, I think he did decent last year. He only played 25 games, but he had 17 points. And he was good in the AHL. And he had a plus, a good plus-minus, too. So that's why I kind of want to keep him on the third line. Uh, this kind of sucks. Uh, I guess I can keep him as our center. He's not one, but... Barely have anyone that plays... Oh, no, I do have all centers here. All right, I guess we'll just have to keep it at that. I guess that works. So I guess this is our team. It's not bad. I'm actually okay with it. Uh, and then we'll put Patan on this line. I suppose. Although I don't know if this guy's going to be that good. This Asplon. Oh, wait, what? Oh, three on three lines aren't fulfilled. But maybe Patan will grow, you know what I mean? He could, so we'll see what happens. Oh, wait, no, he's not Scratch anymore. Okay, so I think that's our team, guys. I think that's pretty much what we got going. Sorry for the episode being pretty long, but I'm excited for this team. I really am. I think they're going to be a great team. Oh, I'm, I'm excited. I definitely am. I I'm, I'm really can't wait to see. what We got Drew in. He's, what, 88, 89? 89, so he could even hit 90. We got Valeno, we got Mantha, we got a killer 
we got a killer team. They're really going to be good this year, and I can't wait to see what happens with these guys. Skinner's going to be leaving the team soon. He's 31, so he'll probably start to decline soon. Of course, I have no interest in getting rid of him because, I mean, he's been a pretty decent player, getting at least 50 points a year for us, so which isn't bad. But, um, but anyway, guys, that is finally going to do it for this episode. Sorry it was pretty long. But uh, I hope you all enjoyed. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And as always, I'll see you guys in the next episode. And thank you all for watching. Peace.